Hi vetmates, this is Jade Aquino and today we will discuss the digestive system of chicken, specifically the small intestine. The objectives of this presentation are the following. Identify the small intestine anatomically. Number two, learn the function of the small intestine. And lastly, understand the importance of small intestine. The small intestine is a tube-like organ that connects to the gizzard and large intestine where feed passes. In mature chicken, small intestine can reach to more than four and a half feet in length. Anatomically, small intestine is divided into three segments, namely the duodenum, jejunum, and ileum. Duodenum originates at the distal end of the gizzard, besides the pancreas. In the duodenum, the dilution of hypochloric acid from proventriculus take place. Enzymes excreted from the pancreas like trypsin and chymotrypsin digest proteins. Amylase breaks down carbohydrates. Lipase breaks down fat in this part. Following is the jejunum and ileum which is difficult to differentiate in birds and these two segments are collectively called as lower intestine. In the ileum, most of the released nutrients are absorbed. Inside the small intestine collectively, villi, a flexible finger-like protrusions line the inner wall that provide surface area for absorption of nutrients like glucose, calcium, vitamin B12, and other remaining products of digestion not absorbed elsewhere. In summary, the small intestine is primary organ of digestion and absorption. Most of the chemical enzymatic digestion and absorption of nutrients and transfer of nutrients from gut into blood and lymphatic system takes place in the small intestine. That would be all for the small intestine. Thank you!